Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a really fun transitional combo that passes through your hip hang and then lets you roll back up into the hoop. This is a beautiful way to transition from gazelle back into a seated position on the hoop gracefully and beautifully. But quickly first, a little advertisement for my channel. Please do take a minute to subscribe and look at all my other videos on my channel. I've got lots and lots and lots of other tutorials for all levels and it really, really helps me out when you guys subscribe and like my videos so please take a minute to do that and uh, I'll really appreciate it okay moving on let's go to pro tips my first pro tip is to have the hoop in your hip crease anytime you're in kind of a hip hang position you really want to have that hoop right where your leg meets your hip in other words your hip crease my second pro tip is to keep your back foot up. You wanna keep your back foot above the level of the hoop so that it will help you roll into the hoop. And my third pro tip is that at the end of this combo, there is a little moment that I cannot for the life of me make look graceful. So my solution was to just move through it as quickly as possible. That way it won't be too noticeable. And those were your pro tips, so now let's break it down. We're gonna start off with a traditional gazelle. If you wanna refresh your gazelle or learn it for the first time, I have a tutorial for that. It is on my channel. I've got the link in the description of this video and it's also at the top of your screen right now. From your gazelle, you're going to place your hands on the hoop, opposite hand to opposite leg. I've got my right leg forward, so I'm placing my left hand next to it on the front of the hoop and my right hand back closer to my back leg. From there, I'm going to take out my back leg, pull with my arms and come into a hip hang position. I've got both legs in front of me and I have moved the bottom bar of the hoop into my hip crease. I'm taking the leg that I just took out of the hoop, for me that is my left leg, and wrapping it around the front of the hoop with my foot coming back through the center. Next up, I'm going to use that foot to push against the side of the hoop as I walk my hands up the opposite side of the hoop, pulling myself up and rotating my hips so that I'm rolling back into the center of the hoop. Here's that little awkward moment. As I get about halfway up, I'm going to scoot myself to face the front, bringing the hoop more onto my thigh and end up with one leg in the hoop facing forward in a seated position. Here's the whole thing in real time once more so you can see how it works. This is a fun way to get out of your gazelle and to come back into the hoop in an interesting manner. Once again, I'll remind you, please do take a minute to check out my channel and subscribe. It makes a big difference and I really appreciate it. And with that, I will see you guys next time.